We're now joined in the studio by Louise Blythe from the BBC. Louise, thanks for coming in. Thanks now, you were responsible for uh, the Fast Train event here at Media City, so how did it go? Oh, thanks, Tom. But in fact, there was a huge team behind it. Um, we had a lot of people involved in the organisation and a lot of people came, as you know, and um, it went really, really well. There was, a, there was a big buzz and I have to say a big thank you to Salford University because, of course, we used a lot of the uh, facilities here and we had around 80 of the students taking part in making it happen and a similar number coming to take part in the master classes and to participate and really kind of access some learning on that level. And I know they really enjoyed it as well. So we were, we were we were very pleased actually and I've got some tremendously positive feedback. It was a great day. Um, one like, very exciting event of the day was the pitch that happened uh, towards oh. the end of, of the day actually and I do hear that some lucky individual won £5,000. I so, know. Yes. That, that, oh, you, you missed a rare treat Tom. You would have enjoyed <laughs> being there because it was really quite tense. The people had to get up live, they had to pitch in front of more than 100 people, there was a panel of commissioners and indeed one lucky person did walk away uh, with an IOU for 5k <laughs> from Peter Salmon which was really quite funny. Um, but what was really interesting thing was um, it's really sort of fired an appetite to do something similar particularly with the students so really it's a question of watch this space because there's an appetite at BBC learning to harness some of the amazing ideas and enthusiasm that's coming out of the student work here at the University of Salford and other universities and to actually pay students to make content to put on the television for learning so um, that's something I know Key News will keep on top of and you'll definitely. probably hear it first <laughs> through you when we get more on that. Definitely now uh, more than 400 people are attended the event. Mm. Um, so is it going to uh, uh, return next year and what new features would you like to be seeing added to the Fast Train event if it will indeed return? Wow, well there's certainly a lot of enthusiasm for it returning. Mm -hmm. BBC North are keen for it to return. Creative Skillset, who are one of the partners, are keen for it to return. Um, ITV the same. You know, some of the big players, including the yep. University of yep. Salford, have a tremendous will. Um, the, okay. the, the things around it are, uh, you know, the finance, the ideas, etc. So we're looking at where we put Brilliant. the money, but we'd like to do it. Thank you very much, Louise. Thank you.